Yo, what is up, guys? So we're gonna continue on with the next episode, and honestly, this looks like a boss fight to me. So let's not even waste any more time. Let's just see. And it does not seem like a boss fight, which is weird, very weird, because this looks like a, like this screams boss fight to me. Uh, am I happy that it's not? I mean, kind of, yeah. I mean, I get to like keep my ammo so that's cool uh this definitely doesn't make me nervous at all <sighs> okay it's an elevator well i mean as close to one as i can be Uh. Is there nothing here? Nope. Oh, cutscene. What the? Oh no, what's his face is here? How the fuck do I fight him though? Not bad. Not bad. I don't have that gun anymore. You're persistent. But I've got a rebellion. So stay out of my All that time to get the fuck up there just that to get bastard. pushed. Yeah, that's my thoughts exactly. Damn it again. Still trips me out that this dude just reattached his fucking arm all willy nilly. Like, like that's just normal. I told you to leave it alone, Ethan. You are in the way. What do you care, Chris? You killed my wife, you son of a bitch. You think I killed Mia? That wasn't her. It was Miranda. What? She's a bioweapon. She changed her appearance and pretended to be Mia. It seems she also survived being shot, so now I'm here to finish the job. Bullshit! Why don't you fucking tell me right away? Because I knew you would want to be involved. And this job is hard enough without civilians getting in the way. Didn't you train him? Why us, Chris? What the hell is going on? All right, Ethan. All right. Can I just point out, this fucking asshole's jacket is, like, so fucking up to the brim, dog? Oh, I, just, I just can't, like, for real. I guess I owe you an explanation. You fucking do. Let's go. Finally. Hand me that wrench. There you go, Dad. I don't know what the fuck to tell you at this point. Long story short, Miranda's fucking insane. In this village, all these monsters and freaks, this is her life's work. Some sort of crazy experiment with the mold. The mold. Like Louisiana. God damn it. All this time, I thought I could save my family. I can't escape from here. I can't do anything. 
might not be true. Take a look at this. My men sent those pictures a few minutes ago. Miranda. Keep looking. Rose. Holy shit, we gotta go! Relax, my men are monitoring the situation. But they have my daughter. You don't get it. You don't stand a chance against Miranda by yourself. <laughs> We'll stay down here and finish planting explosives. Here? You take that elevator. I'll meet you topside. I promise you, we will get your daughter back. Together. Damn straight we will. And when I find Miranda, she's a dead woman. <sighs> All right, Ethan. Then you take this and do me a favor. Try to stay under the radar. It's like, Ethan's just like a fucking potato, for real. You can't turn back now. Obviously, I gotta see what's here. Sweep of the factories, complete no proof of any connection with the organization. Guess this just wasn't our lucky day. I did manage to get my hands on a number of documents disclosing some of Miranda's experiments, which support our previous theories. She seems to have infected herself with the mute, that word, which has granted her a number of abilities, including mimicry. She can control her cells and transform herself to look like anyone or anything. Okay. Uh, she disguised herself as Mia and infiltrated the Winters' house. Her objective was clear to, clearly, ugh, clearly to kidnap Rose. Maybe she thought she could control Rose easier if she looked like her mom. When we attacked, it put a little damper on her plans, so she mimicked a corpse. She then revived herself in the transport truck, killed everyone on board, and took off with Rose. Things didn't go off the way she had originally planned, but in the end, she still got what she wanted. Until now, it's time to rendezvous and blow this place high, sky high. This might turn into a fight with Heisenberg, but I think I found something useful. He left one of his little toys laying around, and it's even made from a metal polymer compass... Comp, 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 oh my god, I'm stupid. Which he can't control. Time to turn the tables. So this dude's like Magneto, essentially. That's what I got from all that. Bro, what the fuck? Like, fucking cyborgs? Werewolves? Vampires? What was the other one that I was, I was saying? Rocket men? Fucking now Magneto? This is exactly the type of fucking tomfoolery I expect from Resident Evil, and I'm about it. I'm okay with this. Metal polymer composite, huh? Time to fight fire with fire. Yeah, dude, like, you just read, we just read of this. I'm coming, Rose. All right, all right. I'm, I may have, I may be. Uh, this, may, this may be a little fun. I'm not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. It's pretty cool. All right, all right. I still find it weird that this is guard, but I mean, whatever. <sighs> I'm not yawning because I'm bored. I'm yawning because I'm tired. There's a difference. Man, this dude, this elevator is taking forever, bro. Okay, now I'm getting bored. You're like a goddamn cockroach. You think you can take me on? This will be my warm up before I kill the bitch. Let's settle this. Man, a man. Your corpse will be another addition to my army. This is the best. I'm having so much fun. This is ridiculous, and I love it. I need rule. <laughs> hey. 
I feel like I'm smiling like an idiot, but it's pretty cool, bro. Said I'm a freedom fighter. I love this dude. This dude is wild. Can you fuck off, homie? Bro, I'm, I'm having way too much fun with this. This is cool. This is so weird. It does not feel like Resident Evil right now. Oh shit, oh shit. Sir? This man really is like, I destroyed your thing. Now you have to fight me realsies. For realsies this time. Do I have a... Right. Oh shit. Talking a lot of shit for someone who's getting fucked up. Grab the tank! Bro, this is so cool. This is so fucking cool, bro. I'm I'm so done. This shit is ridiculous, bro. <laughs> this this is wild. Bro. That was so cool. This is like just the wildest shit ever, bro. Like just ridiculous. Chris, I did it. I killed Eisenberg, bro. Ethan, I heard explosions. What the hell happened? I dealt with Heisenberg. Now I'm gonna find Miranda and get Rose back. Not without me. It's too dangerous. Wait there. You hear me, Ethan? Rose. Ethan! Ethan, respond! 
Mia? What? Our child. She's so important, isn't she? She's everything to me. <laughs> and mine to me. With Heisenberg gone, you've lost your lead. What are you going to do? <sighs> I don't know, but I'm saving Rose. You'd never know, do you? Even when I took Mia's place in your home. Poor Ethan. Who are you? Where's Rose? <laughs> <laughs> Enough. Remember Evelyn and her power over them all? Rose is her successor. No. Rose is Evelyn's true, complete form. She will grow to fully control the masses. And I must have her. Fuck you, you crazy bitch! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was great. Calm yourself. Rose will be saved. The Mega My Seat catalogs all of us. However, she will be reborn as my daughter. She's my child, not yours. Where are you? Show yourself. Why did Rose come to be? Was it because of her parents? And you are truly special. But I've learned all I can from you. Your worth as a lab rat has run out. Miranda! You coward! Come out and face me! Don't worry. Your death will come quick. You will join the Mega My Seeds records. Is that my heart? I will make sure to sample your blood for later. Once dawn breaks, the ceremony will be complete, and I will become her true mother, bound for eternity in blood. <laughs> I've waited so long. Hey, look, that's how Ethan looks. Dreams really can. I can't wait to see my true child again. So Ethan died. Um rightfully so, he's a fucking idiot. <laughs> like I don't know. I just RIP Ethan, I guess. I don't know what to say, dog, really. See, like, Heisenberg, like, they could have been a team. They just went about it too wrong. Like, Heisenberg shouldn't say, oh, I'm going to use your daughter as a weapon. Because that obviously pissed off uh, Ethan. And if Ethan wasn't so damn emotional, you know. confirmed the death of Ethan Winters. I wasn't able to retrieve the body, but I've recorded evidence. Share your screen, and I'll go over the situation. My team and I were careless. Yesterday. We took down the transformed Miranda, but we didn't kill her. Who knew she could fake being a corpse? Since Miranda could have infected Ethan, I forcefully took him and Rose with us. But the vehicle they were riding in was attacked. When I got to the wreck, Ethan and Rose were gone. The last time I was able to contact Ethan, I heard Miranda's voice. She murdered him. And she is not gonna get away with it. God damn it, when does it end? What's that, sir? The mission? All of it. Three years trying to put this thing in the ground. Three years too long. Go get her, Captain. The squad's ready for you. 
That's some big dick energy car right there. So, the play is Chris now? I'm, I'm okay with that. I like Chris. The PSAA got here already. They didn't waste any time. I didn't like Chris in, adjustment. in five, though. No, it doesn't change anything. Terminate Miranda and rescue Rose. That's the mission. And failure's not an option. Let's have some fun, people. Like old times. Move out. Roger. Okay. What the fuck? Does this turn into, like, K9, fucking COD? I want to know what the hell PSAA is doing here. Find out what you can. Roger that. I'm on it. The fuck? No. What is it? No Russian? It's been a while since we fought together, Captain. There's definitely. There's no way I'm not playing as fucking Ethan from now on. Like, this is probably gonna be like something cool to like do later. I don't have to do this, I just have problems. <sighs> I wonder if this game has extra modes. When was it last? The desert? Doing nothing but recon's gotten me out of shape. But thanks to your recon, we know Miranda's plan. Couldn't quite believe it when I heard you turn herself into Mia, though. Taking five shots to the head's nothing to sneeze at, either. Spooky. Okay. I love how I stopped right before the cutscene. Hey Alpha, look at this. Yes, hey, hey. I've gone too far. Christ. It looks pretty rough down there. How are you planning on reaching the objective? First, we're gonna have to take that thing out. Got your back, boss. Let's get to work. I don't want watch for hostile bioweapons. Roger. I don't. I'm confused. I'm Make so confused with right now. Group of hostile bioweapons. There's more than we thought. Kind of feels like mercenary mode, not gonna lie. Roger that. BSAA craft spotted. Two guards. <laughs> this is funny. Oh shit! This definitely feels like a like like an extra game mode for for this game. I'm not even gonna lie, dog. I'm, I'm about it. This is fun so far. Don't get caught. Oh shit, I know where I'm at. Oh shit. What the hell is that thing? It's all new to my seat. That's probably where Miranda is. Let's go. What the fuck? Is this the mold thing? What's over here? Hey boss, it's me. I'm at the location preparing for support fire. Might be a minute. Roger. Tundra here. Leaving some supplies in one of the houses, Captain. Help yourself. Yeah, this is definitely the Go Buck Wild. This is this is for you to have fun mission for sure. 
Because the amount of shit I'm getting so far is just like ridiculous. Umberize, I need some backup. I see you. Two hundred to the point. Oh, this is definitely fucking cool, bro. Fucking dope, bro. Oh, my God, my aim is fucking atrocious. Again, not used to control. Damn, this is big. All right, Lobo. Marking the target. Roger that, boss. Oh, shit, bro. Reloading now. Just a minute. Set, there's no shotgun. Okay, Captain, I'm reloaded. Ready when you are. Bingo! All right. Hold your horses. I'm reloading. It's a small headed that way. Oh, uh, I mean, like, I'm not too worried about it. I got fucking, you know. Ammo for days. Oh, 
sure they're thinking the same about you. God damn it! Oh my god, okay. Let me heal myself real quick. Oh my god, bro. Just how much fucking ammo is this game just gonna throw at me? Like I'm not, I'm not. Com I don't want to sound. I don't want to sound like I'm complaining. I'm just more fucking shocked. Like look at all this fucking ammo, bro. The game was like, yo, we want you to have fun. Go book wild, bro. This is a lot of fucking ammo. Like a lot of ammo. Come on, baby, come on, baby, come on, baby. Hey. Alright. Take that. Good. There, we got it. I found a way down. I'm going in. The rest of you stay back. Captain, I compared the mold of the village with a sample from the bakers and uh, there's no sign of the genome editing we saw in the E series. The stuff originated here. What? Guarding the Megamycete, huh? How is he still here? I killed that bitch. This bitch just Lobo, I got a tough guy here. I'm gonna need backup. Boss, you're on the ground. There's an opening in the roof. Use it! Okay, I'm coming out. Hold on till I get there. Oh shit! I killed you. Um, well, I mean, I should probably do this real quick. And then let's go to flashbang. Ah, that's what I get for looking up. Good. I'll signal with the locator. Give it a good break. Nice. Thought so. Let's uh, do this one because I'm going to need this shit right now. Bro. Ah, 
that hit me. I knew it. I'm reloaded. Where should I point next? I, 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 I don't know where you should aim next. I don't have a. This is gonna have to do it, bro. Oh, that's it. He's dead. For sure. I'll keep going. Don't. The rest of you, stay above ground. The fact that I can... The fact that it gave me that as a treasure makes me believe it's like oh yeah yeah it's we're not done yet like you still have to play as ethan so if miranda was the fake maybe media, where's the real one i doubt she saw any further use for her <clears throat> i don't get any of this how did miranda even know rose exists a moldy little bird told her maybe we can figure that out later <laughs> moldy little bird. focus on the plan I what it. the fuck is that it's the mega my seat oh that's what that is the Mega My Seed? Alpha the squad. I've located the Mega My Seed. So now we can end this mess after all. About damn time. And two explosives armed. There's enough there to blow the whole village sky high. Let's get out of here and blow the damn place. Not before I end Miranda. I'm not taking any more chances. I'm going in. Roger that. Standing by. Captain, I have eyes on Miranda at the ceremony site. Keep your distance. Do not move until I give the order. I know it's too late now, but we really should have told Ethan the plan. There wasn't time. We didn't expect Miranda to act so soon. Even so, you should have told him. Yeah. Yeah. Ethan's death is on Chris, for sure. This must be Miranda's lab. So they're using this to control the bioweapons. Unfit vessel for Eva. Um, obviously, I'm not reading it at this point. I'm just so like Carl Heisenberg. I'm gonna read it. Uh, has electrical organs similar to the electric ray. Narca Japan Japanica. Maybe I don't know. These electric organs are connected to the subject's nervous system can therefore pass and control electricity through the entire body allowing control of magnetic fields which is used to move metal splendid specimen but still an unfit vessel for eva okay is this who i think it is it is okay 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 let's go let's go let's go regeneration rate is incredibly fast the subject can heal any external wound within seconds and grow her nails into claws in mere moments rapid regeneration also means an increased body size due to a hered hereditary blood disease the subject must ingest human flesh and blood on a regular basis to maintain regen regeneration properties I, su I suspect that if the subject's regeneration is not properly balanced then she may mutate uncontrollably which is what we saw okay and then the idiot or the moron whatever salvatore more salvatore 
Low surprising brain function, surprisingly low. The Kado has caused drastic changes to internal organs, transforming them into organs similar to fish-like gills and a swim bladder. Another subject with irregular cell, divi cell division causes him to transform into a giant fish. The subject is unable to control this transformation. Too many defects and unfit vessel for Eve. Uh, huh. Dear Miranda, my deepest apology for not meeting you in person. I would love nothing more than to visit your quaint village once more. However, I am incredibly busy. Then again, I suppose for an immortal woman such as yourself, you no longer remember this poor half-dead medical student in, in the snow. I have always cherished the revelations I came to 15 years ago when I stayed in your village. It's inspired by your research to think one could transform a human by infecting them with an organism positively visionary. You the... I knew that with that knowledge I could achieve my own vision for the next step in human evolution. Even after two world wars and humanity on the cusp of another, my conviction never wavered. I realized, however, through the many nights of intellectual talks you and I shared that your conviction di differed from mine. You hope to bring back a single dead person while I aim to change the world. Experiments on the mold would not have aided me in my endeavor to achieve an exponential infection. I thought a virus would be more effective. This is why, my dear, I had to leave you. I still regret never telling you goodbye. My apologies for reminiscing. I actually have news that I thought might please you. I have found the key to evolution, the progenitor, a virus found in Africa. Plan to start a company with friends and colleagues dedicated to the virus research. I will call it Umbrella, just like the symbol in the cave that we spoke about. I am one step closer to make my vision a reality. I hope you will be able to achieve your goal someday too. You taught me so much and for that I will forever. Spencer, here. Is this game, t th is this the pre, not, not prequel, but. No way. Is this game saying this is where Umbrella started? Who the fuck is that? My Eva. It's been 100 years since I lost you to the Spanish flu. I was so powerless back then. But now I can bring you back to life from the Megamycete. I had to test your new vessel's regeneration abilities. I took her apart and revived her in the Megamycete regulator, the giant's chalice. All that is left is to merge her with the Megamycete. The ceremony can finally begin. After I lost you, I was so stricken with grief that I wandered into a cave to die I so wanted to be with you again, and that's when I found it, the Megamycete, completely by accident. When I touched the black substance, my mind was overcome with knowledge. The Megamycete breaks down and absorbs the consciousness of those who have perished. I knew that if your consciousness was in there too, then there would be a way to bring you back. I just need the right vessel. When I returned to the village, I implanted the villagers with the mold from the Megamycete. That way I can control them, experiment on them. I've experimented on hundreds of people just to find you the perfect vessel. I even tried to increase the the efficiency of finding a vessel by creating a parasite called Kado, yet none of the experiment came to fruition. There were some like Alcina who were close to being perfect, but most turned into lichens. I was once approached by an organization who said they would assist me. I gave them some sort of mold and your DNA, but all they created was another defect, Evelyn. Then again, not complete failure, I learned of Rose thanks to them and I knew she would be the perfect vessel. There was some interference, but I was able to finally verify her suitability. Now my research is finally complete. Eva, I have waited too long to see you again. <clears throat> okay. Show me your hands! Umbrise, this is Alpha. Where is Miranda right now? Still at the ceremony site. Whatever she's doing, she's staying put. God damn. It really is you. I'm glad you saved me. Why are you here? I was caught. In Houston experiments. Wait, did you say Mia? Mia Winters? In the flesh. What's the situation up there? Kind of a war going on. Nothing we can't handle. Don't get distracted. Stick to the mission. I'm headed to the ceremony site. Wait. You can't leave me here. 
You promised, damn it! You said that you would keep us safe. We did everything that you asked. We moved over here, everything! And I didn't care. So long as we were together. So you tell me, where is my husband? He's dead. Where is my daughter? <laughs> She's in pieces. Go on. I couldn't save him. But I can save Rose. Come on. It's not safe here after all. What do you mean he's gone? He's dead. I'm sorry, Mia, but we have to leave. We have to destroy this village. No! You're wrong. I tried to keep this a secret, but... You don't understand how special he is. Ethan? Ethan's alive. Dude had his fucking heart ripped out, bro. I was there. I saw that shit. She fucking squeezed his heart juice in her face. Bro. I don't even know why I'm surprised at this point. Dude reattached his fucking arm. What's going on? Whose kid is this? Someone's there. Okay, this episode's long enough. I'm not gonna make a whole. This is already. This is long enough. Let me know your guys' thoughts in the comments below. Shit's popping off, fucking crazy. We just found out Umbrella started here, kind of. Bro, this is cool. Let me know what you th think in the comments below. If you guys want to follow me on my social media, all the links are in the description below. I thank you all for coming up to this point, and I'll see you guys later.